Today, I'm gonna show you how to make a lanyard that you can hang with your mask. Hi everyone, this is Sky here. Without any further delay, let's start! Today, I'm gonna show you how to make two lanyards. One without breakaway crafts and not adjustable. The second one with breakaway crafts and adjustable. Let's start with the first one, non-adjustable and without breakaway crafts. This lanyard is good if you know exact length you want and it use less ribbon to make. Here are all the surprise and tools you need. Ribbon, snap buttons, snap button tools, ribbon cutter. First, measure the ribbon to the length you want, plus 6 inches. Then make two marks at 3 inches back from the edge, and another two marks at 1.5 inch back from the edge. Cut the ribbon by using ribbon cutter. Using the ribbon cutter will prevent the ribbon from fraying. This step, I will put a snap button on the ribbon. Fold the edge back at one and a half inch mark, and make a hole in the middle with pin tool that come with the snap button set. And apply snap button using the puncher. Make sure that the button snap in place. If not, you can reuse the puncher to punch again. It is no problem if you switch between the male and female size of the button, but make sure that you are not using the same one, otherwise the button cannot be snapped together. Now we are done with the first lanyard. Easy, isn't it? Next, we are going to make the second lanyard with breakaway crafts and adjustable function. This lanyard is great for kids. It adding a safety around kid environment and prevent choking. With an enough force, the breakaway crafts will break open in case of tipping over or accidentally pulling with something. And because it is adjustable function, it, it can be used on adult or kid. It's great if you make it for your family members or friends without knowing their preferable length. Here are all the supplies and tools you need. Same as the first one, only this one we have hooks, slide bar, and breakaway crafts. Cut two pieces of ribbon, 20 inches and 6 inches. Stitch up the hook onto the end of the ribbon for both ribbon. Feel free to use hand stitch if you don't have a sewing machine. A 
and stitch up the breakaway crafts onto the other end of the short ribbon. After you done stitching, the next one would be the slide bar. Slide the slide bar onto the long ribbon. Follow with the breakaway crafts that connect with the short ribbon. Then make a loop back to the slide bar and stitch it in place. Now we are done with our lanyard. Let's try to hook it with our mask. I already include the instruction in the link below for you to download. But if you want to know more details about this video, please feel free to visit my blog at buyskytea.com. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button below for more fun content from my channel. Today, you guys have a good day. Bye.